Hello, hello everyone, welcome back. So I have another a tiny Dollar Tree haul. Um, I found some good items, some new items, I guess you can say, and some, you know, regular stuff that I've been buying. But um, let's get started because this is a real tiny little haul, okay guys? So the first thing that I picked up, I picked up this basket. I thought this was really cute. These are in their Easter baskets. And that's what it is right there. It says a pill, but it's shaped like a basketball hoop, guys. This is really, really cool. And I thought it was really cute for my grandbaby. So I picked up that. And they also had the basketball as well. And it's a little foam ball. It says three and up. But, you know, my daughter just got to make sure that he doesn't put it in his mouth or rips any pieces off. But I thought it was so cute to go with the basketball hoop. I thought that was really, really cute. So I picked up that. Um, and this basket here, um, I did buy him another basket. And uh, this basket here is going to carry his uh, little treats, you know, like um, his little cookies and his little, because uh, he's only nine months old. So he only can have the baby food. Uh, you know the baby snacks and stuff so i'm gonna fill this up with baby snacks and some baby food and um i'm gonna put the ball in here with it and um, so this will be one basket with the food and then the other basket will be with all his little um toys and clothes and other stuff that i have bought him yeah so yeah i thought that was really really cute i really love this i thought that was so cute then i uh, went to the easter section and I bought some Reese's, the peanut butter eggs. And you get uh, four, I think four of them in here. Um, so not bad. I mean, you know, just to throw in um, my grandson's basket, you know, for my daughter and my, and for his dad. So I thought that would be really cute to put in there. You know, just a couple of candies for the parents, not really for him. And then I did find from Charms uh, Blow Pops. Uh, sweet and sour swirl ones. So you got sweet cherry sour uh, lime, and then you got sweet blue rassle sour lemonade, and you got sweet banana sour apple, and you got sweet strawberry sour strawberry lemonade. So I thought these were cute. I mean, like cool. Two treats in one. So I've never seen these before. So they're from Blow Pop, and um, they don't expire into eleven twenty five. So that's really cool. So I picked up those, like I said, just to throw in their basket. And then I did pick up the basket bags from Viola. I think you get two pieces in here. So I picked up those to wrap up his basket. I know I didn't show you the baskets from Valentine's, but um, I did do my daughter's um, basket, but without the plastic and everything. I'll probably post pictures at the end so you can see the Valentine's one, uh, my daughter's and my grandson's. But my grandson's didn't come out very well because um, I overstuffed his basket. So it's kind of, ugh, you know, but my daughter's came out really nice. But I'll post pictures at the end so you can see those, okay? And then, um, and I'll show pictures of this one when I get it done. Um, I should get it done by next week. So I'll probably do another video and I'll show y'all. Then I picked up this, guys, the Happy Easter Little Rabbit. I thought this was so cute. Um, this is Happy Easter decor. And I thought that was sort of cute. I really like it. But I made a mistake because I went to one Dollar Tree um, and there was a greenery in the plus side, in the plus aisle. And um, it was really cute. It was just a long uh, little greenery with flowers. And I don't know if it had eggs in it or not. But I thought it was really cute and you could have clipped this onto it and it would have hanged on your door with flowers on top of him and then him. But I didn't buy it, guys. Now I regret. And they, I can't find it nowhere no more. So yeah, I picked up this. I thought this was really pretty. So I'm just going to hang that out on my front door. I don't know if I'm going to do a wreath because, you know, it's already, we're almost there. And I don't think I'm going to have time to do a wreath. So then um, I picked up some more of the stackable organizer uh, drawers. So I picked up two more of those. 
so like I said, um, you know, I'm trying to organize my Tim Holtz ephemera pieces. So I thought this would really be really cute to put them in. So at least I can see them and use them. So I picked up that. And then I did pick up some of this Real Image Drawing Pad, 30 sheets in here. And this is not from Jot. And usually what I do with this, I tea dye this paper. And I use this um, on my junk journals because it's a really thin um, sheet of paper. Like it's not thin, thin, but it's not thick, thick. It's like just perfect. And so I thought it was really cool. So you get 30 sheets in there. And it says heavyweight ideas for a dry media asset free. That's what it says. So I picked up that. And then, okay guys, I got a couple of more stuff and then I am done. So then I picked up some Colgate uh, Max Fresh uh, Advanced Whiting, uh, 10 times longer lasting cool. So I picked up that. I did pick up some toothbrushes guys, but we already using them because I had to throw away the ones we had. So I've already popped open those. And then I did buy the Snack Factory Pretzel Crisp uh, original deli style rethink your pretzel and this one is a three ounce bag it says non-gmo project verified so uh, it says 330 calories per package so i picked up that and then let me see what else i picked up oh then i did pick up this from jot these are 40 receipts uh, receipt book that's what it says so it's a receipt book with that and then it has the yellow thing when you write on it so I thought this was really cute to put in a junk journal so that's why I picked it up and I really love the the numbers up there so I was thinking that I might end up stamping it or whatever and use it like a receipt and put in a junk journal so I thought that was pretty cool to do so I picked up that and then guys the last two things that I picked up were the storage instances uh collapsible i think collapsible uh basket so let's open this up because i was going to use this one as um uh, my grandson's basket but i thought i was like i don't know i mean it is cute don't get me wrong it is really really cute and this one is the gray and black one so it just collapsed look how simple that is Oops, I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> and it's very loud, too, but it does open, like, really cool. Can you imagine taking this with you to Dollar Tree and go shopping? You know, I might end up just doing that. <laughs> because you have your own little tiny basket to put your stuff in. So I thought that was really cool. So I picked up this one. I picked up the gray and black. And I picked up the white one. Like I said, I had picked up this to use for my grandson's Easter baskets, um, you know, so my daughter can just collapse and put it up or whatever she wants to do. But I don't know. I, I might change my mind. I might end up using this or I might end up using what I have. But yeah, guys, I ran across these and they had other colors as well. But I really like the black and gray and the white one. So that is it, every. Buddy, uh, that's everything I got from Dollar Tree. If you like my videos, thumb them up. Leave me a comment if you wish and subscribe and have a wonderful day. Bye.